so I just kind of wanted to give a little breakdown before we go into the video just so that it's not too much for me to talk about while it's playing. But essentially this is just me working with Juno, who's a Shiba Inu, introducing him to my drum. Now you've probably seen Juno in other ones of my videos, he is, he's my nephew. And you know, he's about, he's just turned two, so he's still that adolescent Shiba. He tends to be reactive to some dogs which we're working on. He can also be kind of reactive to things that move fast or things that he doesn't know. So I figured that it was better for me to introduce him to my drum before I actually needed him to work on the recall video. So this is the first time that he actually gets to see me fly it. So you'll get to see the whole process. I do apologize because the video is a little blurry and I didn't notice that until after I recorded it. And obviously I, you can't repeat the first time. So I still think it's super important to kind of just break down some of the body language here before he reacts. I do have, I think, a, uh, one or two moments that he does try to go after it. But, you know, the exercises aren't perfect and I want to see people, um, I, wanna, I want people to understand the things that I do after a dog reacts. And so uh, without further ado, let's, let's get into this. Let's do it. So first and foremost, I'm doing this on leash just because remember, leash gives us a little bit more structure. It also gives us more control. I'm starting off super simple. Let's just let Juno sniff it, kind of check it out. He did, had no negative reactions to it, just kind of chilling there. So I'm gonna start him with giving him a job. His job is to sit there while we start taking it away. My boyfriend's back there manning it, so you can kind of hear me give him instructions, kind of depending on what Juno's reaction is. I either tell him to move the drone, keep him still, you know, make him go around, whatever. So. As you can see, Juno was a little bit interested. He looked over for a second, but then he looked at me, so I'm rewarding. I'm getting him closer to the thing, but then I'm also backing him away. I'm not letting him stare for too long, because if I let him stare for too long, then he's like, oh, wait, what's that thing? That thing is weird. Right there, he looked, he looked away. Yes, good boy. You can't hear me on the video, but I am saying leave it as this is happening. Right there, see, that was my bad. I let him look for a little bit too long because I was talking to John, but as soon as I redirected him, my hand was down there waiting for him so he can follow my hand because he knows that usually brings him food. So we're going to go back to the drone here. We're going to stay by the drone and then create distance. Movement, it's pretty important when you're dealing with reactivity. So again, he tried to go there. I'm like, nope, uh -uh, leave it, and immediately redirected him backward. Now, because we practice this exercise a lot of walking away, he knows that walking away is more rewarding than him trying to go after it. Good man, Juno. I love that he's keeping most of his eye contact on me. Boy, right there, he looks, he looks away, I treat. Looks, looks away, good. If I start to feel like he's starting to stare a little bit too long, I then move, try to, try to move quickly. This one was, I think, the hardest one for me to get him back. But notice that I keep moving. Even I don't wait for him to either look back at me. I try to keep moving until he walks back to me. And once he walks, yes, good job. But I try not to just stay in one place just waiting for him to look at me. In those moments, they're kind of going into that red zone. So we need to offer guidance with that leash. Good boy, Juno's. All right, come back down. We're landing it. Oh, no, not yet. Good boy, bud. Yes, and you can see that he doesn't want to react. These moments just happen. Good job, buddy. Looks at it, looks at me. Good man. Nice open mouth, nice relaxed body. Way to go, little man. 